There's growing concern about safety and the amount of traffic at Highway 231 and Pipeline Road. Residents in that area have been asking for a traffic light for several years. But as News 13's Carly Horn tells us, state transportation officials say it won't happen overnight. Previously, it was a nice road. Pipeline Road used to be the main access for a handful of residents that lived off Highway 231 in Northern Bay County. Resident Gregory Spears has lived on the street for around 16 years. We had dogs slept in the road. Everybody knew everybody, and um, you could walk. But that's changed over the last few years. Developers have built hundreds of homes in that area. The road was recently paved and extended. With all the new construction and new residences moving in, the new school, the speed limit here um, is 30 miles an hour, but nobody seems to follow that. It's like a speedway. So people try not to walk down the road anymore. Pipeline Road also connects two major roads, Highway 231 and 390. The Florida Department of Transportation is aware of the issues and has heard the complaints. We've seen some increase in traffic numbers. It was also something that was brought up by the locals in this area who felt there was a need for a traffic signal. Satter says the state has plans to add a signal line to the intersection, realign the roadway, and add a left turn lanes in each direction. But the $2.8 million project won't happen until 2025. Meanwhile, the growth continues with more neighborhoods and a new grocery store in the works. A lot of people are shooting across from one side of the pipeline to the other, and they're trying to hurry up and get across 231. So they, they gun it. And once they get that speed, they just continue on down pipeline. In Panama City, Carly Horn, News 13, Panhandle Strong. Department of Transportation officials are holding a hybrid meeting to discuss pipeline road issues tomorrow night from 530 to 630. For more information on how to attend that meeting, you can visit our website, mypanhandle.com.